collection of performers and artists released a video today honoring the thousands of Louisianians who died due to COVID-19. And while New Orleans is known for its jazz, right? This tribute features a form of music that's been rooted in the city for more than 200 years. Tantrong brings us the story and gives us a sneak peek at that new video. Starting the day. Yes. Okay, let's do it. All right. Starting at five, four, three, two. It's the making of a video honoring the souls from Louisiana lost to the COVID-19 pandemic. As an artist, it's it's very fulfilling to be a part of something like this. Tyrone Chambers II is a tenor. He's among the local opera artists and musicians from the Louisiana Philharmonic Orchestra chosen by New Orleans Opera, an organization dedicated to keeping opera alive in the city. There have been operas in New Orleans since 1796. For this solemn project, they chose to perform La Cremosa. This is befitting. It comes from Mozart's Requiem, and Requiem is, is the, the, ma the mass of the dead. It's, it's praying for eternal rest praying for, for peace. We wanted to have a way to recognize and, and celebrate their lives in a way that only we at the opera can with this beautiful music uh, written by Mozart. The pandemic killed more than 10,000 people in Louisiana. And though that can be a heavy loss to comprehend, everybody involved in this video says paying tribute to them can be cathartic. When this idea came about, it was a wonderful reason to reconnect with all these singers and the musicians of the Louisiana Philharmonic Orchestra and provide some employment for them um, so that they could uh, make a living doing the art that they do so well. Chambers remembers the studio session last month to record their voices. Even though we were there to sort of reflect on all the people we'd lost, it was also the first time for many of us that, that we were able to get together again and sing. So there was joy in that. Number one, this song, right? Like, geez Louise, like, <laughs> this is the song you think of. This is the song they put in movies. Krista Rock is the woman behind the camera. In producing this video, Rock wanted to showcase the artists in iconic locations of the city. <laughs> this is for us. The reason why I do it is for us. Um, and I just feel like this is one of the most beautiful ways to pay tribute to those that we lost. Sometimes, words can't fully express the emotions of a time. During those occasions, it's maybe better that we watch and listen. Tan Trung, Eyewitness News. That is awesome, and you can see the full video on New Orleans Opera's website, or you can click on this story once it's posted on WWLTV.com. After several outside performances during the pandemic, we know that this is something that is really just spectacular. So we also know that the opera is going to return to theater performances for the 2021-22 season, so that's great too.